piece for you tonight, uh, which was the up the program, and I'm going to make the blame for that. Um, just the last thing. In the program tonight, this is the first time I've done this. Once I get the program right, I just copy and paste for future reference. So if I messed up, if I didn't spell a name correctly, or if I omitted a name or something, please send me an email and have mercy on me. I know that, that you're here, you want to see the child's name in print. I absolutely understand. Uh, I think I got everybody's. I had kids check over them, but if something's wrong, would you, would you please email me and let me know, and I'll change it for next time. Okay, so you're ready to send the night. Um, also, I wanted to remind percussion parents that tonight, after the concert, the xylophones can go home. Okay? And tomorrow, for class, we need to have, tell me if I'm right about this, Mr. Ball. We need to have practice pads, and we need to have drumsticks, and that's all, right? Or, and the rhythm, yeah, yeah. Um, so if the kids have a stick bag, which most of you did, I think, um, just bring the stick bag and the, and the practice pad and leave the xylophone at home. Okay, what we're gonna do from here on out, would you like to explain how that's gonna work? Okay, do that. Okay, so uh, we tried something a little bit different than here. As you can see, we have these xylophones back here. Um, every single band I've ever seen, and even when I was in sixth grade band, we had these little bell kids, and they're okay, but I wanted to try something a little bit different. And so we were able to get these uh, these xylophones. So we're actually the, the first ones in the state to try this. And I've actually talked to a lot of different directors, and they're gonna try and do it. So we're starting a trend here, which is really, really cool. Um, so what we've done is, from our first day until now, they have just played on the xylophone. Now with percussion, we do xylophone, snare drum, bass drum, timpani, cymbals, triangle, we, you name it, we play. But what I've always found is students normally get really good at the snare drum and not quite as good on the xylophone. So I wanted to focus just on xylophone up to this point. So what we're gonna do is the kids can now take these home and they can practice these. And this whole week we're just gonna do snare drum, I'll introduce all that, and then from here on out, I'm going to, to divide the kids into two different groups. So half the groups will play xylophone on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and the other half is going to play xylophone on Tuesday, Thursday, and every other Friday. So they'll have one day of snare and one day of mallets, and we'll go back and forth. So percussion parents, they need to make sure they have their stick bag with their percussion or their xylophone mallets, snare sticks, drum pad every day. So they'll be going back and forth. And now we'll start it. Okay, so the last, just for this this coming week, from here on, we're, for the next week, we're just going to do snare, so we can kind of catch up. We haven't played snare at all. We haven't done anything with snare sticks. Okay. All right. Then the last thing uh, is after this final tune is over, I'm going to send with Mr. Bowl, and I'm going to send the kids out this door that says B5 back here. And if you want to collect them and take them home tonight, I'll have them meet you back out there in the lobby if you want. Just just go. Enjoy their food. I don't know where they'll be because I'm going out there too, but whatever. Anyway, um, but I'm going to send them out that way with Mr. Bowling. They can get their cases and coats and they'll come back around and meet you out here in this hallway. Okay? If I send them that same way as you, nobody gets to go anywhere. Okay? It's